The next contestant is someone who is one of the tallest girls I have ever laid my eyes on. Give it up for none other than Tanushri. Tanushri, give it up for Tanushri. Thank you. Tanushri, you look lovely and very, very tall. Um, <laughs> my first question to you is what kind of obstacles did you have to overcome to compete in this pageant? You know, coming from a very small place uh, from Bihar, people are not very happy about pageants or modeling. So we don't have awareness about modeling and pageantry world and this industry as well. So we have to explain to people what this means and how beautiful pageants are. And they give you a voice to speak. They give you a platform where people can hear you and you can set example for. Beautiful. Um, my next question to you is, what do you think is the most important social issue facing our generation? I think the biggest social issue our generation is facing is finding themselves because there is a lot of things and there is a lot of pressure on us to do something good in life and, and uh, social media has, has uh, uh, become a platform where everyone does something good and there is unrealistic examples as well. So finding yourself in the process and finding where you belong is, is uh, I think one of the biggest obstacles. I think that's very rightly said and very rightly put. Thank you for that. Um, how do you carry forward your work regarding child education in times like COVID? I think education is very integral part of uh, anyone's life. It plays a massive role in anyone's future on, or the, even on the present uh, life. So I think uh, education cannot be stopped anyways. We can have alternate ways to do so. Uh, online, online is one way. And we can also take precautions and go ahead and contribute our bit. Because, you know, when you educate a child, you shape their future. And it's something very beautiful to do. How did you and your social organization or the NGO you've been working with handled um, imparting education to poor kids, to kids from uh, lower financial backgrounds? Have you, how have you done that in the times like COVID? Uh, I've, I am not a part of any NGO, but I did my bit from my side. So I went to many orphanages. So I know it, it breaks my heart to see children having no parents because I was raised by a single parent and I know it's hard to be to have no family and I think it's very important for them to learn because it's just it's it motivates them to do something good in life and in COVID times um, like I said uh, we can take precautions and go ahead anyone can go ahead and teach them it's beautiful we can share so much with them and our experiences would help them a lot um, I want to, because you've been raised by a single parent, uh, not looking at it as a taboo, can you tell us some fun moments that you've had with your one of the, one single parent so that we know we'll be, you'll be in good hands and you can probably be one of the four con winners of Gamlan Supermodel. Okay. Um, so being raised by a single parent was very fun, you know, you can share a lot of moments with your mother, with your mother because I was raised by my mother. So we travel together, we have a lot of fun, she, she follows every post that our pageant does and she's so excited, Tanu, you have a picture. Aaya. Wow. <laughs> so I think it's fun and it, it gives you a lot of strength because it's uh, your mother is your strength and she has always put an example how beautifully she can do everything alone so i think she has done a beautiful job and i think she has molded me the way i am today i think she did a wonderful job as well my last question to you is what has been the most fulfilling experiences um in your visitors visits to orphanages in times like covid you know um when you visit them, the smile they have on their face because they don't have a family and you belong belong, and you come as out as a family to them and you share smile, you share moments, you share multiple things that they don't have. And I also visited a mental hospital and you know, they were so happy. They, they were abandoned, they, someone le some, some were left and no one had visited them in a long time. So I think it's great to see their smile. They feel like someone from their family has come because we are raised in a family and I have been raised in a huge family. I have a joint family. Mm -hmm. So I think it feels great to have someone around and you feel 
you feel uh, happy sharing moments that's lovely thank you so much it was beautiful the girl who shared my name as well give it up for tanushree thank you, thank you tanushree